Hi everyone, it's Athena. Welcome back to my channel. It's the 29th of June, 2021. Okay. I'm hearing... Better to have lost than lost your identity. Okay. This is a general reading. I'm going to use the Tarot Royale for what's been going on and then use the Vice Versa deck for what is to come. All right. This is a general reading. Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Four of Wands with the Justice card. So what do we have here? The Queen of Wands looking at family, family unity, dealing with a home, property, something legal, trying to balance out the score trying to figure out how to um, maybe purchase a home for the family. And let's take one more to see. Oh, gosh, look at this. And the Ten of Cups. So family is of great importance here with the Queen of Cups, right? Family dynamic. How do I balance out one with the other, so to speak? kids, issues, making sure everyone's happy, right? Do we balance out do we balance out the scales of fairness within a family dynamic, right? Who said what? Who did what? And looking up looking as this could be you are the head of the family and you are could be expanding the family. Maybe there's some, I feel with the justice card, it's all about what's fair in families, two families coming together also, right? Uniting, could be a wedding. Someone has gotten married and two families are coming together for that. That's nice. I like that. <laughs> right? It's like about time. All right. Let's see what's going on. So this has already happened, right? Where someone is bringing two families together, making sure that things are balanced. Of course, we have the two, right? We have the two scales with, with the two little doggies. So it's more, it's about loyalty in a family. We have the two ducks, same thing. I'm sure they're, yeah, the two little ducks, right? So it's about the balance, balancing of the scales in fairness, loyalty of two families uniting, the loyalty of two people coming together to get married in a family, you know, maybe meeting for the first time. They haven't met each other's family, and that could be, sorry, families coming together to meet one another or it's a wedding, right? Okay, let's see what's going on. That's been what's been going on, right? It could be happening this weekend. All right, let's see. I know it's early in the week, but who knows? All right, so here's the Ten of Cups reversed, right? Why is the Ten of Cups reversed when here it's upright? So I'm being told that we should... We should work backwards. Let's see. I mean, it's not going to matter. Yeah. Two of cups reversed. Five of wands upright. And one more. Two more. That's what we're being, or three more. We're being given three. And look at that. The six of wands. Someone who, okay, so... There has been a situation where a family
family unit came together, that maybe someone's married, someone got married, someone is thinking heavily about family, about and looking two of wands, okay? So either way this story unfolds, right? Either way the story unfolds, there seems to be, which is the middle card is the five of wands. There's been a disagreement. There's been an argument. There's been competition. There is struggle in a union that once was very happy, right? There's people involved. There's not just two people. We have five here and then we have six here. So we have a situation of two families, right? You could say three, three or something like that or whatever. You know what I'm saying? It's a situation where there's a coming together, but we're not seeing eye to eye. Whereas maybe before we did see eye to eye, right? There's conflict. There's, there is, I'm hearing boisterous communication. He said, she said, is there competition? Is there just hands down fighting? And where, why? Why is it happening? It, does someone want to leave the premises because it's just so chaotic? Something here is really chaotic. Someone could be feasibly in the public eye. People are talking about what's going on. Someone thinks truly that they won and the other said, I'm out. One said, I won the battle here. I won the fight. I feel this one won the fight, obviously, six of wands, right? And who's and that's why the justice is here, because there could have been something that was they were dealing with that wasn't fair or needed to be fair. And so they had to fight it out. They had to literally verbally fight it out. And the other person is like, I'm out. So one feels that they won and the other feels like they're like, okay, I'll just, I'll just watch you take a bow. I heard take a bow. There's not a coming together in a family dynamic where people are fighting. Let's look at the bottom of the deck. Six of Pentacles could be finances. Well, you you know, this property belongs to you. This property belongs to you. There's the justice card with the six of pentacles. It's all about how much money, how much time, who we, who was there longer, right? I'm hearing, um, what's that called? Um, in Europe, it's um, squatter's rights. I'm hearing something about squatter's rights here with a property, with several properties. Well, we've been here for so long. How can you even possibly think that you would, that you could possibly take this when we've been living here? That squatter's right. Uh, typically it's what, seven years, I believe that if you're, if you have, if you have left a property for, seven years vacant, someone else can claim it within your family unit. Sorry, I'm playing. And then we have the page of cups reversed here, right? So there's no love loss in this situation. And it's about money. Like I was there, yeah, look at this. And it happens suddenly. Something happens suddenly where someone just literally comes out and starts and starts this this is happening now because this is in the now 
no love lost in a family dynamic where it's like, listen, I, I am going to stick up for myself. You can say what you want, but there's an issue of justice with regard to property. Again, I feel it's something about squatters' rights. Someone feels like they did win, and the other is like, you know what? I'm going, I'm looking around somewhere else. I'm going to move. I'm going to decide to just take my, take my money elsewhere. And look, on the bottom of the deck, I can't help but say four of wands reversed. Someone's going to, someone's going to take their money and move elsewhere. Someone's got a legal issue, a financial legal issue that has to be divided upon or fought for. Someone's fighting for it and someone else is saying, okay, you win. Go ahead. I'm not fighting anymore. I'm taking my money. I'm going to take my pentacle and I'm going to go purchase something with my person. Right? And maybe there was a situation where you were, you were, I feel this is not about two couple, a couple having an argument. I don't. I feel that the couple was involved in one of the family dynamics. There's a couple involved, right? It could also be when someone passes on, right? The logistics I hear of property the properties, you know, trying to split the properties and or figure out who owns what and who gets what. And someone's just saying, listen, I'm not going to fight anymore. I'm just going to go. And that's what's happening. Wow. That is rather quick. But whatever does happen does come out of the blue. Someone finds out some information that they're like, see, someone finds out information. What's this? The King of Wands. So we have a we have a Cancer Pisces Scorpio Aries Leo Sag. This could be all in one person if you're a water and or fire sign who you find out some stuff that just shakes you up to the core, but you're like, Well, I have to deal with it because justice has to be served. So you're either fighting for for a property or you're fighting to win, fighting, to just say, I'm out. It's just like what the daily said. It's better to have lost and kept your identity in check. And while the other person walks and wins. So someone's winning and someone's losing. Because obviously there's an issue here that's involved two sides, literally three sides as we know, right? There's always three sides to the story. But here, there's only two sides being told. And it does involve money and the justice card of who's going to get, inherit, excuse me, whatever that is with property. And someone's saying it's not worth it. So... Take it. Take it all. Right? And the other is like, hey, I won everything. So the question is today, truly, is it better to have lost an issue, clearly an issue that you had to go fight for something, but... In the, in the same breath, you lost your identity and or people lost respect for you, right? Because maybe you were playing hardball and someone else said, I'm out. And it could be a couple who didn't see eye to eye in a situation too. But I feel someone is gone, right? So I feel this is a property of after a passing, of property, you know, separation of property within families. Okay, have a great day, and I'm sending you lots of love.